I remember what I said last year for my answer, and I said California because it's warm. I got a quest. Uh, I got a quest. When the Girl, I got a question for you. Can I get an answer? Like, the weather is never cold. Like, even on its coldest days, because I've been to California before, even on, like, cold days, it's, like, 68 degrees, but it's, like, always sunny. And it did rain, but it only ever rained at night, and we never went anywhere at night. Forget what I said last year. I'm going with New York this year, because I also forgot to account that the question says five years. I'll spend five years in New York, and I don't have to, like, worry about finances, or at least I'm neglecting all of the financial burden that I'll be taking on. In in California, I'm just in like some little isolated town where like not much is probably going on and then I gotta like drive to go places where as if I'm in New York, I can just like walk or Uber up a couple blocks. I don't really gotta do anything extra. Plus like the shop after shop after shop after shop after shop and since I'm not worried about finances, I'ma ball out. I'ma just, every single day, I'm just gonna buy something new. I said it's confined though. I'm breaking that rule. Ain't nothing confined to me. I'ma go anywhere I want to if I'm in New York, anytime I please, because I'm a grown man, even though I'm not like real adult. I'm not like a real adult size. I'm not adult size if you see me in person. Don't ask me about it. I'ma give you attitude. Still going with New York, cause it's fun. And I'm going there in like a month. It's kind of, I don't want to say that's it because there's so much to do. Like, I don't know. I feel as though like if I was in New York, I could literally plan something to do like every day and I could literally do like a handful of things in that same day. Whereas in California, in an isolated town, I would have to like plan to go one place specifically, spend a significant amount of time there to get the enjoyment out of it and then go all the way back home. And like California, although there's a lot to do out there, everything can be a distance. Where as if I'm in an urban mecca, I'm on the block. It means I'm only a few blocks down from where I really need to go. Or at least I know how far it is. Like it's not a whole bunch of GPS work that I gotta do out in California. On top of that, like just because I'm in an isolated town in California, uh, that's like earthquake city. There's, it's a whole state. The whole state is just fault lines and shifting tectonic plates. I don't, I'm not used to the ground shaking. It happened once here in Delaware because we caught an aftershock from an earthquake that happened in Virginia like seven years ago. And I was in my basement at the time. So I was like, yo, the house is shaking. There's only like one guess. Mine immediately was earthquake. And then I, I remembered I own a dog too, so I had to run upstairs and make sure she was okay. She was looking at me like what we were supposed to do. And I was like, I don't know, we just gotta let it pass. Like, I don't think we should run out the house. They say get in the doorway. She was already in the doorway. My dog was smart, RIP Carmen. But because of the shopping and I really just been wanting to binge on buying stuff lately, to be completely honest, even though I know I shouldn't, I should be reinvesting into <laughs> making better videos for you guys. And I'm definitely trying, but I still like to buy clothes. Like, I didn't used to be like this, but then I got like this. So now, this is me. And I think, I think that's my answer. I think that's as best as an answer as I'm gonna give you guys. I think there's bigger malls in California. I don't think that's enough to sway my vote for New York. What is this bug? Yo, we're getting new bugs, man. I swear, and the spiders are just getting bigger. But anyway, I'm gonna end this video, go home and make me a sandwich because I'm hungry. So give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Follow me on Instagram. I'll put that across the screen right here. I'm still not decided on what other video I'm gonna make next, whether it be another questions video or another like video about me per se. But I definitely got some story time videos in the works. Definitely got like some special like cinematic projects that I've been conjuring up while I'm at home doing nothing, doing nothing. You know, I've been getting crazy headaches like this past week because uh, stuff has just been on my mind for me to do. But anyway, I'll see you guys later.